This is what freedom looks like. It's freedom for Michael Foradori, a 23-year-old Mississippi man who's the first buyer of a mobility rover, the invention of a USF engineering student. Unreal. I'm still waiting on it to kick in the back of my head that I'm in Tampa, Florida right now sitting on a pole in a wheelchair, you know. We showed you a prototype of the rover last year when we took you to Rehab Ideas, a company formed in part by the USF Center for Rehabilitation Engineering and Technology. And there's nothing powered on this, on this kit except the wheels of the wheelchair, and the wheels of the wheelchair basically drive the rollers. The rover is the creation of Travis Watkins, a former student in USF's engineering capstone course who wanted to help his father take his motorized wheelchair on the beach. Michael praises Travis and other USF students who create devices that Rehab Ideas brings to market to assist people with disabilities. This says a lot about their character and personality to actually want to do something like this to help somebody out. We take so much for granted being able-bodied and to be able to give that kind of independence back to a person that they deserve is, is words, you can't even put words to that. Michael, who was injured in a fall during a fight nine years ago, will use the rover to explore the 40 plus acres of property he owns in Mississippi. Oh, I'm gonna see it. <laughs> if I have to take a couple trees down along the way, I'm gonna see it. For University Beats, I'm Mark Schreiner. For more information on this University Beat or to view previous segments, log on to WUSF.org and click on the University Beat link.